Welcome to the Mint Report, our wrap-up of the day's business news. Here are the top stories. Car sales are dismal in 2011-12, but could pick up. Airtel starts to unveil 4G services. And markets end Tuesday flat. India's car industry is still recovering from a bad year. New figures confirm what was widely suspected. The passenger vehicle saw sluggish sales in 2011-12 thanks to a slowing economy, high interest rates and fuel costs. On the bright side, commercial vehicles did well during the fiscal. And what's more, industry body Siam expects robust overall sales this year. Numbers from Siam show sales in passenger cars grew just 2.19% in 2011 and 12, but its forecast for this year is 10 to 12% growth. Utility vehicles did much better with a 16.47% surge in sales. But that's expected to moderate this fiscal once again to the 10 to 12% range. The sales growth for 2011-12 is the lowest since the time of the financial crisis. Siam says some key factors will encourage more car purchases this year. These include an expected reduction in interest rates and stable fuel prices. In other news, you could be using 4G mobile services very soon. On Tuesday, Bharti Airtel, the country's biggest telecom operator, launched its 4G network in Kolkata. It now plans to roll out the services in Bangalore within the next 30 days. 4G services allow for high-speed broadband access on mobile devices. And finally, Indian markets made modest gains on Tuesday after the previous session's losses. The Sensex rose 22 points to 17,244, and the Nifty nudged up 9 points to 5,244 by the end of trade. Some banking stocks rose during Tuesday's session. SBI jumped up 2.37% on the BSE to 2,151. An HDFC bank climbed 0.3% to 524, while ICICI Bank proved an exception, with a loss of 0.64%. Not all shares fared well during the day. Some did badly ahead of the earnings season. Infosys, which posts its results on Friday, dropped 1.63% on the BSE, while its larger rival TCS tumbled 0.51%. And that's all we have for you. Thank you for watching.